All right, Earth Science. I lost storage. I have like 10,000 fucking pictures and videos on my phone. So I had to clear some space. But um, so I think I left off saying that somebody may have been upset that they wanted to kiss your lips. Uh, but they're, they were unable to do that because they were with someone else. So they're kicking themselves in the ass about it. Yeah, they were non, non-committal. They were trying to be committal, but I don't know. I don't know. Ego death, money's coming, traumatized. I'm choosing them. So somebody could have chosen someone else. Um, I don't know. Take it for what it is. I'm not really feeling that too heavy, but uh, so some of you guys are taking your power back or you're needing to ask for your power back. So ask for any and all power that you've given out. Pull it back. Uh, some of you guys may want to do some cord cutting uh, rituals if um, you're constantly thinking or wanting someone and you're just not, you know, you know, it's not the right person for you. Uh, so cut the cord on them. I do co cord cutting uh, rituals for 40. It's explained on my website, rootsandrewards.com, if you'd like to purchase it. I've gotten some good reviews from it. I'll send you a meditation to do along with the ritual. And someone wants to date you. This person wants to date you. Meeting someone new, dating, getting back out there, and planning and setting a date. So let's see what this person wants to say that they're unable to say please forgive me on the bottom of the deck so it could be past influence or please forgive me for waiting for so long all right here we go again it didn't it didn't clear out all of the uh videos so it stopped me again so you guys may be used to like stop and go connections and you're just like this shit just ain't for me um so this person may have been stop and go and they're just like please forgive me i dream about you you know they're dreaming about you this person may have needed time or maybe you've needed time to resolve some inner childhood issues uh, someone's no longer fearing the connection. So there was a, f there was fear or there is fear at the beginning of this relationship when this person comes in, but I think it's going to really uh, smooth itself out. I'm manifesting you back here and they don't want you to release them. This connection is a blessing for me and I'm jealous. I told you at the beginning of the read, this person is jealous. I'll never forget you. So once they meet you, they'll never be able to say goodbye to you. All right. Um, sexy time here. I'm seeing signs of you everywhere. So someone's knowing that a divine partnership is coming in, whether you know this person or you don't know this person just yet. Someone is feeling a divine masculine or feminine coming in for them. Sexy time oracle deck. It's available on my website check it out oh no that's the love me love me not this is the sexy time intimate messages let's see what they want to say that they're unable to say you pussy so soft oh they're gonna lie you cute cat did you do laser or brazilian or wax or you're just shading it magnetic connection mm-hmm I want to slip your panties to the side. Yeah, because it's so smooth. <laughs> they like how smooth. They've never felt something so smooth before. I want to get on it. Nibble on my neck. So they like when you take a little nibble on their neck. Let's see. Come back, baby. So some of these are past people not heavy though comeback baby is just letting me know that once you go round for round with this motherfucker you just they're gonna keep saying come back baby come back come back for round two and three and four and five somebody got stamina somebody doing their cardio meet in the shower mm. okay so caught all right we just did it but now come in the shower let's do it in the shower too <laughs> 
Seems to be all over the place fucking this person. You're saying goodbye to your old life. Person loves your big brown eyes. You just, even though you have like these deep brown eyes, it's just like ocean eyes. Like they just, they see so deep into your soul. They look at you and they just see through. They see through you. So, or this is how you feel about this person. Somebody sees past the facade and the mask and the ego that somebody may be in. Somebody sees your vulnerability. They see the softness. They see the care. They see the compassion that you hold. And this is why they like desire you even more. I think you, you eye fuck this person. <laughs> The eye contact is just like, you just, you just get like sparked the fuck up when this person just looks at you. Because you just tell, you could just tell they got love energy for you. I'll wrap my hands around your neck with love. That's what I'm saying. This person may choke you out, but they're doing it in such a loving way. <laughs> they just want to choke you with love. Look, that's it. Because you'd give them good oral pleasure. They fall in love with your mouth. Maybe you got the gift of gab. I love that ass. So they're attracted to your booty butt. I want to caress your body. They want to get a hold of you. And it was just lust in reverse. So it's not just a lustful connection between the two of you. Maybe some of you guys it started with like licking the tip and meeting the shower. And let me put your panties to the side and shit. But yeah, it has turned. <laughs> Tables have turned. It's no longer uh, that energy. You're no longer allowing that energy to, to come forward and run amok on your life. So this person actually, you know, they, they want to date. They want to emotionally invest. They, they want commitment. They see future investment with you. And who could this be? Let's see. Curious. Who's coming in for the earth signs? meeting someone new oops mercury 15 virgo gemini uh sagittarius nine so september 15th this person may be coming in for you who else ah. fire signs leo aries sage 23 cancer 14 September 14th, September 15th. Oops, date. Yeah. Heavily attracted to you. Neptune, I was feeling you. Pisces energy. 21, September 21st. And Mars, Aries, 17, September 17th. Let's do some dice. I'm liking this energy, so I'm going to go further with it. Hopefully, I can mesh all the videos together, and it won't be three separate videos, but there may be a part one, two, and three. We shall see. Okay, Gemini 24. Oh, that's uh, Sagittarius. That's J Jupiter. Let me see. Oh, yeah, Jupiter. It connects with Sagittarius. Pertaining to luck, good fortune, what propels you forward, what your values are, and prosperous events are coming in for you. And 7th, maybe on the 7th of August, 7th house represents partnerships, personal or business. A new person in your life may become significant, like I said. 
um, can relate to contracts, marriage, and matters of law. And could be connected with the Gemini. Seeing both sides intrigued. This person's intrigued by you. Somebody does some overthinking, making sure that you're not oversharing. Devious, manipulative, intellectual distress. So somebody may be trying to stress you out, a Gemini. Um, they're oversharing, they're gossiping, uh, they're devious, and you're just needing to stay away from that person. Uh, they hold grudges, they resent you, they resist changing or taking accountability. Who the fuck knows? Uh, like I said, there's up to five to seven people in your life that you just blocking and closing out and you're just like, eh, I ain't want to talk to you anymore, motherfucker. You ain't, you ain't enlightening, enlightening me. You ain't giving me shit. You're a motherfucking shit show. Self-care. You could do to help higher your frequency. If anybody's interested in Qigong, I have a class every Wednesday and every Friday at 10 a.m you want a free pass let me know if you live near the Middlesex County area I'll hook you up ovaries so check GYN exams fibroids cervical screening all right making sure that everything's working correctly uterus ground yourself so go outside get more grounded you may go want to go by waterfalls or streams. Stop having sex with people that don't deserve your fucking punana. Don't deserve your cookie. So you're holding back. Becoming celibate, I see here. So you're going to check your, your, your sexual organs. Making sure that there's no problems with your sexual organs. Getting a clean bill of health grounding yourself and then seeing that you want to continue or you want to become celibate and uh, you will wait for sex when there is a family dynamic where you can see yourself having a daughter or starting a family with the person that's how long you're going to hold hold your sexual desires out for Okay. You're going to connect with crystals, so you may throw some crystals in your bra and your nightstands. And you're really getting yourself back into alignment or, or into alignment. Maybe you've never been in an alignment because you've always taken on sexual energy, sexual connections with people, and you have their devilish ways uh, being placed on you. So you're uh, saying wusa, you're connecting with all the chakras, full alignment, feeling really good energetically as you move forward. All right. So that's good. Let's get some initials and then I'm gonna let you go. I gotta finish my TikTok reads. Uh, JR, R&R, &R, hello, you need some R&R &R time, somebody may do jiu-jitsu, RR, PR, could be Puerto Rican, JP, PJ, RP, RJ, S, B, you're just like, son of a bitch, His name could be Sebastian, uh, from PA, Six, no longer taking sense. Could be 55, 56, 65, May 6, June 5th. You, it's only you for this person. It could be Peruvian. Somebody's kitty's purring. <laughs> uh you may have just went to a BP station or somebody works at a gas station. Somebody has a bachelor's degree. Uh, you're calling BS on people, going cold on people, and you're creating a gap between you and someone here. Someone likes to stay in their pajamas. Um, so comfortable clothing, 
You may feel like someone's a hoe, H-O, maybe from New Zealand, Nevada, Vancouver. You're going to a Zen, a Zen energy, a very comfortable, peaceful energy. Taking yourself out of the bullshit. You may have bros, or this person has a couple bros. Uh, you may travel in the HOV lane. Giovanni, you may like Bon Jovi. Bro code, Boris. One of your boys, or maybe one of your friends wants your man. Or your man wants one of your friends or some shit. Um, somebody may work for Boar's Head. RS. 